Welcome everyone to the first sunny day this entire week. I'm taking advantage of it by washing my bike. Got it looking good so we can go out for some rides. But that's not what today's video is about. Today's video is actually a follow up on a video that I made last week on Clarkman's Razor Quad. If for some reason you missed that one, I spent some time in the video taking this whole thing apart, trying to get under here to get to the battery, which I was able to remove. After I took the battery out and took it to the battery shop, I had to leave you on a bit of a cliffhanger because the guy at the battery shop told me that he might be able to get the battery working and I wouldn't have to buy a new one. Unfortunately, that wasn't the case. He couldn't get the one battery to hold a charge. So we got two new ones here from April of 2021 and that cost me $44, but should be all that I need to get this thing running. So on that, join me today as I attempt to install a battery for the first time in a Razor Quad and get this thing running for Clarkman to try out today. Step one, remove the bicycle from the top of it. Easy. Step two, remove the training wheels from the top of it and throw training wheels away because we don't need them anymore. And remove helmet and pads. Those will come in handy later, at least the helmet will. That leaves us with what we actually need and parts that have fallen on the ground that I have to somehow remember where they went. Someone wrote their name on here. Someone named Clark. We'll do this in reverse order. We'll get the battery in first, which is gonna require this. And for us to be on this side, This should be no problem. We're just gonna take this. Put it right under there. And this needs plugged into this, which you probably can't see at all. Ooh, it sparked. Is this thing on? Yeah, this should probably not be on. I'm gonna get electrocuted. Holy, there we go. That's the ticket. Super easy to take this all apart. All I used was one of these wrenches. I can't remember which one it was. And these. I can't remember which one this was either. <laughs> it was a lucky guess last time, I remember that. It was maybe, maybe this one. Let's see if we can get lucky. No, it's smaller than that. Shoot. I'm supposed to be professional over here. No, seriously. Let's go four. That's the one, it's four, four millimeter. As you turn this, this will kind of tighten down on it. I do remember this kind of being a pain though because it starts to get in the way because this is a little bit shorter and starts hitting the top of that. So it's, it's kind of a pain in the butt. I don't think I like these wires being under here like that and getting pinched. I think I'm gonna take this back off unfortunately and I'm gonna put those on top. So much better without all those wires being trapped under there. But that's step one. Now I gotta put this onto the side. And I kept all of the screws in there so I didn't lose them, at least hopefully. And yeah, we'll hide the battery. You do need a Phillips head screwdriver for this job as well. I'll make sure I list all the tools at the end in case anyone's out there trying to do this. And for some reason you're using this as a tutorial. God bless you. You wouldn't believe the times that I wish I had a cameraman. Life would be so simple, so easy, but that's okay. There's a screw going in there and I can feel it tightening down, which is good. There's three of these that have to go in. Good. Before we put these feet holders or whatever these things are called, We've got to put two screws under here that go up right there and right there. Not easy to see, but you get the idea. And for the record, this is five millimeters, which is why I think I initially went for that one. Cause I think all the rest of these are. Hey, come here, guard dog. You're very dangerous, aren't you? I can tell, you're ferocious. With the FedEx truck on, the guard dog is at ease. And I'll put my last screw into the bottom of this, or whatever you want to call it, bolts. I don't know what they are. That was pretty darn easy, and now we get into the even easier part, which is putting these things on. I got all my little washers together. Basically, these were sitting on here like this. And they were on there okay the day that I took this apart, but over time, they kind of just fall off. But I have them all here, which is good. And then we can just put these on the side and 
have a razor quad. Screwdriver goes on the top, wrench goes in the bottom, and then you just turn the screwdriver holding the wrench in place until it's nice and tight. While I'm tightening this, I just had a big brain idea, and that is why don't I charge this while I'm working on it? I could plug it in right over there and then let it charge for a bit since I'm gonna do that anyway. Might as well get a head start, right? I don't mind the mess, but I have the charger here. I just need an extension cord. Definitely overkill for the job, but it should get us there. It says it's charging. We shall see. Since you saw pretty much how to do this whole thing, I'm just gonna finish this job and show you what it looks like when it's all finished up. You know I love you too much to make you suffer through this with me, but I should. I should, but I won't. Look at that foot holder, just being all in there, perfect. That one too. And not only that, but we've got a green light, which means it's fully charged. It's all coming together. Full power. Oh, look at that. Awesome. I'm bringing it out here because like my bike, it's gonna get a wash. out of the way over here so it can dry off a bit. All the time, energy, expense, and work is done. Now it's time for the fun part. We go pick up Clark Man, bring him home, and let him run this thing around a little bit. Try it out. The thing that I want to surprise you with is inside the garage right there. My four wheeler! It's ready. What? Yep. <laughs> we should put a helmet on you. It's been a while since you rode. <laughs> Put that on your melon. Boom. Remember how to use this thing? Yeah, this is for So you gotta turn it on down there. Press, press the top there. Okay, now it's on. And now your throttle is right there. Just twist that back towards you. There it goes. Oh my God, that's scary. Just don't go on the road, okay? This scares me. <laughs> I know, it's been a year since you rode it. <laughs> If the wind's really loud, I'm sorry, but we're out here. Whoa, you almost got my foot, bro! <laughs> what do you think? I love this thing. The new battery, fully fixed. We can really break this thing in this summer, I think. <laughs> of a camp. Not actually break it. <laughs> Metaphorically break it. Oof. Probably actually break it, though, too. Wee! I fly into the creek and... You I could do. probably take this thing in the water, I think, as long as we don't get the battery underwater. So you could go up to about that deep. <laughs> what about this deep? <laughs> yeah, this battery be underwater. It may or may not be okay, but I, I don't think it'd be a great idea. Let's see how fast this thing can go. I want to see a speed test. Oh, man. <laughs> that was amazing. You just got to get comfortable on it. You'll be okay. It takes some time. That guy was like, did you see that guy's bike? Is that Clark, man? I was so scared when I turned around so full speed. I turned around with maximum speed. <laughs> That's a quick turn. I took like a I love you. I love you too. <laughs> You're a little crazy on that throttle, aren't you? Man, this thing is amazing. Yeah, dude, I'm so happy that we got the battery fixed because that was a bummer. It was just sitting in there not doing anything. Battery was dead. How did it stop? Uh, the battery wore down over time and they couldn't bring it back, so we had to put two new batteries in there. 
And now it should be it good. It takes two batteries. It takes two batteries. It takes. It should take forty hundred thousand. It'd be really fast, probably. <laughs> Put a lipo in this. Boom. Uh, watch me soar in the sky to outer space. Let's go. I would love that. Tune into our next video. Dad makes Clark Man a rocket. <laughs> 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 I'm gonna chase you. <laughs> Get back here! <laughs> I think I can run faster than that thing. Ready? Three, two, one, go. <laughs> I just wanted to stop because I'm, I was scared. Well, I stop when I'm scared. It's okay. You try to. <laughs> hey! Get back here! We need to put a mower on that thing. Sheesh. <laughs> it's how does it done the nut run on your toes. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Hope you enjoy your four wheeler, bud. Thank you, Dad. Look! Awesome, bud. A jet? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. That's cool.